Hi, so bear of bad news here. I'm an idiot. So I joined the game, I made the comment that, oh, we've not lost a session in a while. Then I immediately discovered that, well, my voice was coming through fine and couldn't hear a thing from anyone else. It was there. If I boost it up to like max on the audio process, you can hear the occasional laugh. It's just decided to record it at such a low level. I've taken steps to uh, stop that. Um, I'm completely rewritten my um, streaming protocol. Hopefully, we shouldn't see any of that again. But, you know, I've been having a few problems with this recently. Hopefully, I've sorted it. Anyway, I thought I should give you a quick update of what's going on. So, they rescued the god. They freed him from a, the encasement of gold. He was a bit arrogant, not too bad. Um, they didn't really get much from him. They managed to get a trade agreement going where they're shipping large amounts of gold down to their cities. But apart from that, the real interest was when they went through the desks and found out that um, Aurea had, has a sister called Jade. Apparently, Daddy likes her more. She's been generally considered... The, most of the letters were telling them that she was underperforming. She was never going to be good as a sister. Really, really heartwarming stuff. It's obviously a loving family. But it did give them a idea that there was this thing was happening through another god of jade somewhere else. So they immediately set south uh, and run into some guards after a few weeks of travel because, you know, it's about a thousand miles difference. They stopped off at Great Forks just to basically set a few things up and then head on south. But when they ran into contact with the um, a, a ship from this nation... We immediately told them the nation didn't exist, having decided that jade being, having a massive pillar of jade in the middle of the city that regrows because of your god, not something you want to be sharing with the outside world. So, they managed though, through amazing bureaucracy and BSing, to convince them they were here for a religious festival that just happened to be going on. It's something like six successes, that's pretty reality warping. Um, they start praising the god, heading south, and getting to the city. At which point they discover it's an Aztec city and its sacrifices. Managing to avoid a limit break, they decide the best way to infiltrate the temple is to join in these sacrifices. Not wanting to actually sacrifice somebody. Um, so discards of this cloud. Yeah, I think it's cloud. It comes up with an amazing mannequin that's realistic with like organs inside and blood, splitting blood. Yeah, we we had a lot of fun this session. And I'm very annoyed we lost it. Yeah, he, he, they go in, they perform their fake sacrifice, dump the mannequin somewhere, and then one group just sneaks in, and the other murders a few priests and sneaks in. And that's where we left it. The group themselves are not... They're not very happy. They're pretty sure they're going to have to burn this city to the ground afterwards, even if the goddess... They did say the goddess has been doing this for 50 years, so it's not a recent thing. She's been doing this for a while, so... There's probably not much here to save the goddess. So, next session will be, can they defeat the the obvious death knight who's hanging around? Can they do, probably kill a god? Um, and then convert another city to communism with as little bloodshed as possible. Now, now Malsef is here, we know how it's going to end. So, again, sorry for losing the session. And hopefully you can come back next week and enjoy the, the, an actual proper recording with better sound quality from me. See ya.